Xin chào tất cả các em học sinh Chào mừng các em đã quay trở lại với chương trình bồi dưỡng tiếng Anh lớp 10 Và hôm nay chúng ta sẽ tiếp tục bước vào tiếp cuối cùng của bài 6 Global Warming, Looking Back and Project Now, we come to the first part of Looking Back is that pronunciation Now, in pronunciation, we come to activity 1, listen and repeat 1. Listen and repeat the questions. Paying attention to the rising intonation. 1. Do you know that global warming is increasing? 2. Did you turn off the light before you left home? 3. Can we really reduce the carbon footprint of our homes? 4. Are you aware of the dangers of plastic bags on the environment? 5. Have you seen the Young Voices for the Planet films? Now we come to Activity 2. Listen and mark. 2. Listen and mark the rising intonation. On to echo questions. Then practice. Reading the changes. 1. Plant for the planet help plant 12 billion trees worldwide. 12 billion trees worldwide? 2. Even when turned off, electronic devices use energy. Yes, they can still use energy. 3. Cutting down on energy use is the best way to help reduce global warming. The best way to do what? 4. Global warming has catastrophic effects on humans. Global warming has what on humans? 5. A single tree can absorb about 1 tonne of carbon dioxide during its lifetime. How long can a tree live? Let's move to the second part of looking back today, vocabulary. And in the vocabulary, we come to completion. Complete the sentences with the words in the box. Now, I believe that the only way for us to reduce global warming is to cut down on so, energy use. Many species are threatened with due to deforestation and loss of habitats. So, number two, we match up extinction. Motor vehicle running on petrol are responsible for a large amount of carbon dioxide. Number three, what emission? There are many ways for us to reduce our carbon footprint in order to save our environment. Number five, Many more trees should be planted as they absorb, absorb. Number six, the alarming rate of result in damage to the quality of the land. So number six, we match what? Deforestation. Seven, rainforests have the highest species. So species, diversity on the earth. And the final, global warming has proved truly catastrophic for the environment. Now we come to the third part of looking back today is grammar. And the first part of grammar today, rewriting. Grammar 1. Rewrite the sentences using perfect participles. Now, first one, having learned about the benefit of recycle, benefit of the recycle, recycling and reusing and 
be using the student started collecting the student started collecting waste paper paper portal portals and and pins to recycle and reuse to recycles and reuse continue number two we do the similar to number one and after doing from number two to number six press on submit button let's move to activity two combination two combine the sentences using perfect gerund Tonya had dumped a lot of rubbish on the beach. She was strongly criticized for that. So the first one, Tonya was strong, strongly, strongly criticized for having dumped or Having dumped, dumped a lot of rubbish on the beach. A lot of rubbish on the beach. Or number two, Sam had not worked hard enough for his previous job. Sam regretted not having worked hard enough in his previous job. Or three, Tony has rescued the kid from the fire. People admire him for that. So people admire Tony for having rescued the kids from the fire. Four, I have seen him before. I remember that. So I remember having seen him before. Five, you lied to us. The villagers said the politician denied it. So the politician denied having lied. To the villager and said Han has forgotten to turn up the gas cooker before he left his house. He admitted that Han admitted having forgotten to turn up the gas cooker before leaving the house before he left the house. Okay, so now doing the exercise and then press on the paper to check your answers. Now we come to the second part, main part today is projects, and in projects, you can do. Uh, you can work in groups and discuss which of the following activities your group can do to help to reduce the carbon footprint of your school and community. And as you can see, I would like to introduce you. First one is that you can plant in trees. You can plant trees. Yeah? Or start a 3D campaign like recycle, reduce, reuse. Or organize a community cleanup. Or sometimes you're raising money to protect wildlife. Or raising people awareness about the dangers of global warming and how to reduce its effects. And after you do a lot of things, you can save our Earth. And after you work with your group, you give your group's activity a campaign name and think about its purpose. They make a detailed plan using the table below. Project. One. Working groups. Discuss which of the following activities your group can do to help to reduce the carbon footprint of your school and your community. Now, like I introduced for you, in PowerPoint and now if you use IC books you can press on show answers to consult more information what can we do to help to reduce the carbon footprint of our school we can plant green trees around the school and we can encourage other students to learn about the bad effect of carbon footprint 
I agree with you. Moreover, I think that we should organize a community cleanup. Two, give your group's activity a campaign name and think about its purpose. Then make a detailed plan using the table below. Now, if you are in the groups, the teacher will guide you to do, and you can prepare at home before it comes into class. And if you use IC book, you can press on show's answer to know more about information. Yeah, for example. Three, present your group's detailed plan to the class. Now, after you do the activities, now present your group's detailed plan to the class. Now, we've just finished up looking back and protests of UNICEF at home. Review all information in Unit 6. Prepare the next lesson, Unit 7. Don't forget to access IC books to practice every day. Thank you for your listening. Goodbye.